I'm Badri Shaparna. I'm a business leader with over 25 years of experience in various industries, managing simple customers, simple projects to complex projects. I'm going to share my experience with one such complex project, which was primarily from the electronics manufacturing sector. The background is, this was a leading CD DVD manufacturer in the world, growing from number 3 or 4 to become the number 2. And our project program was very simple. We had to implement sustainable solutions, sustainable, planned technology upgrades, and increase overall business footprint. Fundamentally, what we have to understand in an electronic industry is that it is changing every day. It imposes a lot of challenges and complexities in day-to-day -day handling. The normal business itself, which I call the day-to-day -day operations, had certain complexities. First one was, we had to work on forecast. We need to know what direction the market is taking, how much yield consumed from my product. The forecast would essentially result in an order, planning, then we would have advising our manufacturing plant in US, in Japan, maybe in uh, Europe to schedule their production. After the ship, we have to make sure that all the previous shipments have been paid for and there will be some emergency, short shipments, excess shipments, wrong shipments. Still, it had to be going back, going back and forth. Now, it looks like a very simple process, but please believe we were doing this for about 18 products coming from about 6 manufacturing plants supplying to 3 or 4 SEZs which means it was not an easy task each had a different documentation, different cycle day to day managing was that you know we had to keep a track and if something went wrong either in giving the material or getting the payment we had to either find an alternative or we had to give a substitute or we had to stop because payment has not been made. It was a very tough task, but it was needed because this was one of the complexities. The more challenging was, while we were doing the day-to-day -day business, as you know, in the electronic industry, there are a lot of things which we work for in the future. The future solutions. The future solutions meant that we had to give a lot of products free, start with the pilot trials, scale it up, and give it as a long-term solution. So you have two dimensions of the same business. One works on cost, maintainability, compliance. The second one, the future, free, trying to do a lot of things together. That means on one side you are fighting, on another side you are trying to shake hands because we want to move forward. Now, this kind of situation poses risks. One is that we have to be present all the time to make sure that competition doesn't enter or make sure that whatever we were doing was not falling into the wrong hands though we had NDA in place we had a second challenge that because it was a sensitive area the CD DVD was working on very long evolution platforms so they did not want their competitors or their people to come and try to observe what was happening in their plant which meant all the suppliers including us they had restrictions so in our organizations there were only two people who were allowed to enter the plant so if one of them who was sitting in the headquarters was not well i had to rush let's go back apart from what we said as a limited access we had two more difficulties one is because it was a cyclical or unsteady business something i'll tell you Depending on the PlayStation 2 success, the number of DVDs produced were changed. Depending on the number of contracts with Sony or Panasonic or somebody else gave, the volumes would change. We still had difficulties in payments as I said. While we had risk on one side, the tougher task was we had uncertainties. The uncertainties posed a bigger challenge. To give an example, CD or DVD making uses polycarbonates, dyes and metals. Now, the, because of a high volume business which they were in, the global prices would determine which format would they take up for manufacturing, which in turn would decide what product we will take. Then there was an evolution of Blu-ray 
There was also a competition from HD DVD. Today there is a big change. We know where the direction is, but in those days it was very difficult. Difficult, more difficult. The main market which they were supplying, Europe, had imposed anti-dumping duty. So we had to provide some support which was legal to make sure that they stay in business, we stay in business. The OEMs which were supplying machinery to the project in this segment, they had a big shakeout. Many companies were being acquired, which means if we did a lot of work with OEM A, if the product came from OEM B, there was a possibility that we did not have a business. The project expansion timing was also determined by the VC, the venture capitalists. The drives themselves, which were using the CD DVD, they were evolving. Single layer, dual layer, this laser, that laser. Which means while we were managing a lot of things on a day to day basis, we were also grappling with a lot of things which were totally unknown to my customer, unpredictable, still we had to live with it. So, how we did? We did face the uncertainty. This is a common factor for all industries, but please remember keep our program direction intact. You have to tweak it depending on the developments which take place, but fundamentally it has to be the same. Risks are an imperative in business. We have to find ways, and this, in my experience, doesn't come without warning. It gives you some signs of malfunctioning, some kind of red alarm. We should be sensitive to that, and we should be able to mitigate as much as possible. We have to run regular business because if the bottom line is not touched, we can do a lot of things more productive. So, in a sense, if you look at it, every business today, if you ask me, is a complex business because there are uncertainties, there are challenges and what we require is an open mind and we have to be proactive, then only we will be able to see the success. I am sure you will benefit. All the best. Thank you.